a 2010 Yamaha YZF R125. This bike is HRI clear, so it's never been categorized by the insurance or been involved in a major crash. Obviously in this video, I'm gonna show you around the bike and all the good and bad points about it. So starting you off as always, chain and sprocket in good condition, rear tire still has plenty of tread. RNG tail tidy with LED sequential indicators around. LED tail light. Brake disc and pads on the rear are in good condition. Looks like I've got a Scorpion exhaust. Or it could be a uh, replica, but it does look very nice. It sounds nice. Uh, the rear sets have been sprayed green, which is really nice. Always on LED indicators on the front here, LED side lights. Standard low beam, high beam, painted front screen, front tyres in good condition, brake disc and pads in good condition as well. Nice clean bolts throughout the bike as you can see. These fairings are in very good clean condition, they're not nice purple and green. Does give it a really nice stunning look. Underneath here nice and neat. Rear arms clean, chain guard, mud guard nice and neat as well. Pillion seat, but the foot pegs have been removed. Main seat is in good condition. The seat lock doesn't work as the little pin has been removed. I believe they are cheap to find online. Ignition works fine though, and fuel cap. It's got aftermarket bar ends, standard grips, but adjustable levers. Standard mirrors. Front end is very clean. It's got the front splitter. Alloys are nice and neat as well, with nice wheel stickers on them. Looks like a washer on this side and on the other side, uh, as their gap was too big for the bolts. I'm sure if you wanted to, you could probably get smaller washers and paint them the same colour. The side fairings are neat, the infills are nice and neat as well. So, two keys. Very good overall condition. Uh, with the engine on this, it has recently just had a top end rebuild uh, due to it having a 180 kit previously. So that's why it does idle a little bit higher as it was adjusted to fit the 180 kit. Uh, but it does run smooth, goes through all the gears smooth. Clutch is a really good biting point. I mean, currently it's on 34,000 miles, but it runs really nice. Starts up on the button nicely. Would recommend obviously with this kit just to not always redline it, let it wear in on its own so it lasts you a good long time. Make sure you give it a regular service just to keep fresh oil on it. But it's in very good clean condition this bike. I think a couple of little hairline cracks on the dash but it doesn't affect its use. It's a very common thing with them. But it's very clean, ready to ride away. It'll come with a good long MOT. But that will be everything for this 2010 Yamaha YZF R125. Thank you.